For the first time in more than a decade, our AFC South defending champion Jacksonville Jaguars have an opportunity to put together back-to-back -to -back winning season. The team, the team trying to accomplish the feat for the first time since the 2004-2005 seasons. Shaz Pirani, boy, he's been all over it this week, talking to Jags, coaches, and players about what this organization has done in the last decade to ensure they'll win for years to come. Shaz. Chris, I spoke to offensive lineman Tyler Shatley earlier this week, the longest tenure Jag on this roster. Been here for 10 years, joined the team in 2014 as an undrafted free agent. Now, Tyler, he has seen a lot. I mean, a lot. He's seen the worst season in Jags history when they went 1-15, but also two playoff experiences. So he's seen his quite bit of share here. We've really been able to just build a culture, you know, last year, starting last year. And, and you know, obviously starting all of the years before, like, uh, the good and the bad are all part of the foundation, and, you know, you, you, you need both. The Jaguars have experienced their fair share, but the front office has been steering things in a winning direction. They're putting us in the right situations. Um, they're building a team. They're putting the pieces in that and all the guys that can play together. You know, it's not just about one guy. And now the fan buy-in has also increased. When we get here early on Sundays for the game and there's already people in the parking lot, you know, there's people, there's just excitement and that helps, you know, build that culture again because you can kind of see the fruits of your labor. Improvements on the field are also being noticed by the NFL. For the first time since 2008, the Jags got three primetime games in one season. It's nice to see, people want to see the Jags, people want to watch, and, and now we have the opportunity to show, showcase what we're doing here and remind guys, like, hey, like, it's one week at a time, man, because they could turn around quick, and I've seen it do that, and it's not a lot of fun. So it's a good perspective to keep to kind of keep, you know, keep us moving forward. So Tyler said he wants this team to go to the Super Bowl and win their first in franchise history. He believes the possibilities are limitless here in Jacksonville. But every single game matters now looking forward. You can't take a step back. you got to look forward. And Tyler also mentioned that it's nice to have the Jags be so consistently good towards the end of his career. He said this himself. He's getting towards the end of that reign. But it's nice to see all this happening now. But Every single win starts tonight and here with the Ravens first of all, Chris.